how many times are you sick of hitting it flush on the range, we get to the golf course and we don't actually perform. Today I'm going to test myself, but there's something I want you to do as well, over one hole. This is a brand new Training Tuesday video. Go on the golf course because you're not learning to score. This is learning to score. This is the golden nugget of information on this video. Now, since we are talking golf balls today and we're talking the worst ball in golf, what golf ball do you currently game? I'm a little bit between two golf balls at the minute. So I'm trying to keep my eye on the road and an eye on you guys. Um, I'm between Pro V1X and the Strixen XV. Now they're the two golf balls that I've, a Strixen XV is the golf ball that I've used for a long time, but I've been dabbling with the new Pro V1X. I can't quite make my mind up. In today's video, I'm gonna be using the Pro V1X and it's gonna involve the worst ball in golf. Right, without further ado, I'm gonna to head to the third hole here on the Pines course and I'm gonna do this test. But it goes without saying, if you are a brand new viewer to this channel, make sure you smash that thumbs up button and subscribe. Today's Trading Tuesday, but we also have vlogs on Wednesdays, challenges on Thursdays, and Sundays is all about can you do this? I'm gonna leave you to check that out. Today I'm at the stunning Paneiro Altos. I'm down here in the Algarve in Portugal. Weather in Manchester at the minute is absolutely terrible. So it's fantastic that I've got the opportunity to come down here. So in today's video, yeah, it's gonna be a tough one for me. It's gonna involve the worst ball in golf. What could it be? As you can see, this hole is absolutely stunning. The big pines that come over really impede your tee shot here on the third hole. So why have I hit two balls off the tee? Well, we're doing the worst ball in golf. So in the worst ball of golf, for one hole, I've got to continuously choose the ball that is in the worst position. My first one was a nice little healy cut. Safe, probably right rough, it's probably finished off. Second one was absolutely flushed. So I've got to go and take the one that I flushed back to my one that I healed. And I've got to play the hole out from here. Now, I think if you can get around here in bogey is absolutely impressive in this kind of test because it's just so hard. And yeah, you even have to do it when you get up there too, to the green. So I hit the tee shot, pretty good tee shots. One flush, one down the right. Let's go and find them. So my one that I hit down the right ended up here. My flush ball was nicely in the middle of the fairway, but got to bring the ball back. Now, you might be asking and wondering what kind of the benefits of this are. Well, remember at the start of the video, I said to you, do you ever find that you can flush it on the range, but then you find it hard to take it to the course? Well, this actually gets you into scoring mode, gets you into playing mode, and not where our little finger is in our swing, because any time we're like that, and this is what I really want to reiterate to you on Training Tuesday, it's so hard to play golf. Now, I, admittedly, the tee was down there. It probably wasn't driver here. One good, one bad. I'm still in play. Let's see if I can make better than a bogey. Because if I can do that, I'm going to be absolutely ecstatic because it's such a hard test. Remember, bring your best ball back to your worst ball and play the hole from there. Make it even harder for yourself. I'll shop it up here then. Knee height, drop it in. That's exactly how you would play it if it landed here. Well, I need to make 
sure I'd do better than that one. Well, worst one. I've got to play with that. So ball number two, ball number one, that means I've got to take this one back to there, see if I can get down into to there. You probably can't quite tell from here, but that, that flag is literally just on the top of a plateau. This is going to make this pretty difficult. I probably should chip this. Mm. Let me know, if you're playing this shot right now, would you chip this or would you go with the chickens option like I'm doing? So you can clearly see how much harder this is than actually playing one golf ball. So going back to the training Tuesday and the whole philosophy behind this, if we can train harder than we actually play, that's really going to help us when we get out on the golf course on a Saturday, on a Sunday, playing against our mates. This is a great way to have a competition against yourself. So hit these putts and I'm going to talk to you about the golden reason why this is my favourite test, the worst ball in golf. Bring this one back. Try and hold a putt. I think it's safe to say if I bring one of them back, I should make the boat. Bring it back to the worst. my golden nugget of this information is the fact that we're out on the golf course one we're creating shots we're getting into an actual shot mode that was what we said before but the real nuggets behind this information is that we're on the golf course and we're actually learning to score something we don't even practice and that's that's that, that absolutely astounds me when people say yeah yeah hit 30 40 50 balls in the range hit it good then play a good on the golf course. Because you're not learning to score. This is learning to score. This is the golden nugget of information on this video. You're learning to score, you're learning to play golf. And if you make your training harder, and fun, by the way, that was quite, well, meant to be fun, then actually you're gonna start to enjoy your golf much more. That, that, that is it. So that is the worst ball in golf completed. I think what we've got to realise here is that golf is much more than hitting it on the range. You've got to get out on the golf course. So if you did enjoy all this content today, guys, make sure you do smash that subscribe button. And as always, leave me a comment down below on what videos you want to see in the future here on Alex Elliott Golf.